Hi, my name is Stephanie. Welcome back to my channel. Today it's the first day of term. Uh, so I'm basically my first official week with lectures just started. Today it's Monday. It's Monday night already. Um, I really did not have anything exciting to do today. Like literally, I'm just now getting ready to go grab dinner at college. That's it. I have zero plans for today. Also, the rest of the week is quite calm. I'm quite worried that it might be the calm before the storm. I don't know. We'll see. I'm just going to grab dinner and I'll check in tomorrow. Good morning! It is Tuesday today and I have my first ever lecture today. It is pre-recorded on Canvas, unfortunately. If you don't know what Canvas is, it's like this online platform where professors and lecturers post uh, videos, more information, reading lists, syllabi, the type of stuff usually you'll find out on Canvas. See what an actual Oxford lecture is like, because I've never ever had one before, so it's kind of exciting. Anyways, I'm going to go to my lecture. It is more of sort of a general lecture in a way. It's not very much catered to my specific subject that I chose to do. Well, it is, but it's in a way it's not. It's kind of like, so I'm doing modern languages, and this lecture is also for people who are doing French, or Italian, or Spanish, or German, or basically any other modern language that offers. Anyways, I'm just gonna see what it's like, and I'll report back. So I've just finished watching the first half of my first ever lecture. It took me a while to actually find the lecture uploaded online. It was like kind of hidden in a way. I don't know. I just didn't look it up beforehand. I like literally spent 20 minutes searching whether this was the right lecture or not. In the end, I found it. I needed like some time to like get into lectures again. Like I haven't been to a lecture in over a year. Uh, I had a gap year last year, so I didn't do any like, school or university like that. So I, I kind of, I kind of struggled a little bit to like start up with. Anyhow, I was planning on being done by one, but I spent so much time searching for this uploaded lecture and I've like wasted half an hour and I'm pretty hungry, so that's the reason why I only watched half of it for now. So I'm going to the grocery store to get some garlic of all items because I can make lunch. After that, I'll pop back in and finish my lecture. I just got back from Sainsbury's and I got my garlic and they had strainers. I've never been so happy to locate a freaking strainer. I needed one so badly. I have been looking everywhere for strainers and just Sainsbury's, just my little local Sainsbury's just had them sit there, like in a corner of the store. And I've been walking past them for like, I don't know how long, but they have strainers. I don't know, my life is complete right now. I'm just so happy. <laughs> I think I have like all of my kitchen utensils now. I think I'm complete. I just went to an introduction of one of the clubs that I was interested in, specifically the rival club. And um, it's like one of the oldest uh, clubs that are associated with Oxford, so I thought it might be fun to check it out. They said to us, like, we'll meet everybody at the Sheldonian. So we were all just standing there outside, waiting <laughs> and waiting. And nobody showed up, but there were other people who were also interested in the same club who were just like showing up. So at one point, there were like a good 15 of us just standing there waiting. No one showed up, so we emailed them, etc. etc. But we were just like, well, we just might as well walk to the point where they said that they would like end with the Oxford tour. Pulled up there, and I was like, at the moment, I was like, well, it's been 45 minutes, we have not seen any of them. Uh, I'm just going to dip. They showed up. We're like, oh, so sorry. We just thought there was like five people and we didn't notice that there was like 15 of you just like standing there. I was like, how do you, I was like two minutes early. How did you not notice that there was a whole group out there just waiting? However, we found them, got like talked to them for a little bit and then just popped out. But I'm kind of like low key pissed because I missed my college dinner because of this. And it was steak and ale pie with Guinness. I was like so excited for that. So I'm just so with a glass of wine and watch some YouTube and have dinner here. It's Wednesday today and the weather is beautiful, the sun is shining, like you can see how bright it is. So today I am getting some vaccinations done 
that I still need for Oxford. They're not like mandatory, but they're like, well, you probably should get those. It's a good idea. One of which is the meningitis one and I'm getting the HPV one, which I never got 10 years ago. I'm back from the doctor's office. I got my shots. I had two, one in each arm. Very lovely. So anyway, I need to come back for my uh, HPV one because I need three of those. Because, oh, that's not three. This is three. I need three of those because I'm older. Otherwise you can do two. So right now I'm off to Brasenose College. Never been to Brasenose before. There is a membership drive from Lost Society and I showed Lost Society so I get to pick up my free piece of stash. <laughs> Made it back to my room from the Law Society membership drive and I picked up my free piece of stash and I picked up this blue crew neck. I love crew necks. I love navy crew necks. So this made my day. It has like the Oxford Law Society logo on it. So I got to see some of Brace Nose, which is also a very gorgeous college. So for tonight, I am going to dinner with people from my course. We're going to have ramen noodles. We're going to a restaurant that's in Westgate. Great opportunity for me to check Westgate out. Westgate is kind of like the large shopping center that's like indoors. I have not been there yet, so I'm just. I think I'm just going to go a little bit early, walk around, uh, see if I can maybe find Allen keys because my handlebar of my bicycle has been loose for the past I don't know week and a half. I just came back from dinner with people who were on my course. Had a nice evening. We did not end up going to another pub afterwards because currently with COVID, it's really hard to like book a pub on the night. You have to like do that like three or four days in advance. This was the outfit. I was where I felt like dressing up just a little bit. I don't know. I haven't like dressed up for a while. It's almost lunchtime. I'm still wearing my pajamas, but I have finished my final book for my reading list for my literature course. So I'm very happy to just like very symbolically put it onto my wonderful stack of books that I've finished. Twelve of those. I'm very happy to have just finished this. So for the rest of the for the rest of the day, I'm running some errands, I'm doing some laundry, and I will have dinner in college again today. Apart from that, that's all I'm doing today. Tomorrow I'll just start studying and working on my lectures and preparing those that I have next week. And I have formal hall on Friday. I've gotten an email like the day before yesterday saying that I actually got a spot for formal hall. Mm -hmm. I like so excited. <laughs> Um, so I get to wear my gown. Good morning. It's a Friday morning already. Um, I had a bunch of plans for stuff that I wanted to do yesterday. I didn't do any of those things. <laughs> I did do like other stuff. Today it's going to be a very busy day and now I have to like do these things as well. <laughs> I just find out that I am officially on a ballot to run for the MCR as a vice president. So ballots are supposed to be sent out on Monday. Anyways, the most fun thing I have today is formal hall. So I get to dress up and wear my gown and go to dinner in college. <laughs> Besides that, I signed up for lunch today, which is fish and chips. I don't like fish, <laughs> but apparently they're very good at making it. So I decided I want to give it a try and find out somewhere in March that I actually like it. And I have a, a library slot booked, which is like basically starting right now at nine o'clock in the morning. I'm really late for my library slot. Uh, there's a bunch of like free slots at the moment, so it doesn't really matter that I'm a little late. I've done some studying. I had lunch in a hall. We had fish and chips. I never, I'm not quite a fish person, not that into fish. However, it was actually pretty good. So might actually come back for that. So right now I will be running some errands. I will be getting some tights. Um, oh God, I, I need to return something to Boots, but I didn't bring it. It's like very, very stupid, but oh well. Hi, I just ran most of my errands. I found a pair of tights that I needed for my subfest tomorrow. Like I own tights, but I want to have like a nice proper pair of tights because they're going to be taking pictures of us. You have of pictures that like your parents are going to buy. So I wanted to have a nice pair of tights. So I got those. I also randomly had a bunch of pair of shoes. Never go into TK Maxx. I always come out with shoes or like something. I don't know, I should not have gone in there. Anyway, so I found a pair of shoes and um, a little bottle of Prosecco for after matriculation. Tomorrow, uh, yeah, that's tomorrow already. Yeah, so I basically did a bunch of like last minute type errands. 
and I did most of them, which I'm really happy about. Only one thing was sold out, so I need to like pop back in to get that. Anyways, I'm going to upload my room tour right now and work on my thumbnail and put it up on YouTube. Hi, I just got back from my MCR meeting to figure out what like Vice President needs to do that type of stuff because I'm running for that. Now I have like, I don't know, eight minutes <laughs> to like change into my outfit and walk back to college for formal. But hey, Oxford life, whatever. So I'm gonna change right now and I'll just see you when I'm fully dressed up and stuff with my gown. Hi, so this is the outfit for tonight. I uh, we're just wearing like a you can't really tell I'm wearing like a black dress and I'm wearing my black gown with the streamers. The gown like comes to my knees. You can tell and I'm just like wearing ugh loafers so it's just like this i'm so happy i get to wear my gown i'm so excited mm -hmm. 